we're definitely dealing with the influx of drier air now moving into the valley. But here's a live look from Isa Blanca Park at South Padre Island right now. 78 degrees. Those uh, winds still a bit gusty there, but those temperatures on the warming trend. We are going to surpass the 80 degree mark. Winds right now out of the west southwest between 15 and 18 miles an hour. Seeing those gusts up to 25 miles an hour in the upper 70s in McAllen. West Laco 77 degrees. Brownsville already at 83. As we plan the rest of our afternoon, we are expecting those winds to pick up with those gusts up to 30 miles an hour. We're going to get up to about 85 degrees and then overnight lows dropping into the 60s. But we are expecting another reinforcing cold front in the overnight hours. But first, dealing with that elevated fire weather risk that's going to be in effect for this afternoon. So dry air, windy conditions is causing fire concerns across the valley. So outdoor burning really not recommended for today because any wildfires that do happen, they're going to spread rapidly. So definitely be very cautious as we are dealing with a bit more drier air uh, later this afternoon. The National Weather Service issuing that fire weather warning for Hidalgo and Star counties and then areas in Willacy and Cameron counties are under a elevated fire weather risk there. So we are expecting uh, those conditions to be dangerously dry. Here's the weather setup. We are seeing two cold fronts moving through the state of Texas right now. The first front that's moving through the valley, bringing some drier air. Those temperatures still warming. However, another reinforcing cold front just behind that, bringing some cooler conditions that are going to be uh, causing those overnight temperatures to drop into the 40s. And we're going to keep those breezy conditions in store for us for tomorrow morning. So we're going to see some wind chills in the upper 30s. So definitely get those jackets back out because Friday morning, Really cold for the valley as well as those high temperatures only topping out in the 60s. We're going to have a high pressure system move on in across Texas. This is going to clear our skies out for Friday there. Highs only in the 60s, but mostly sunny conditions. We are expecting some increasing cloud cover as we head into Saturday and Sunday. So we could see a few showers out of this, but for uh, Saturday and Sunday highs in the upper 60s, 70s. So we're going to be seeing roller coaster temperatures at least for the next several days here across the valley. And then for next week, highs surpassing that 85 degree mark in the upper 80s in some locations for Tuesday and Wednesday with mostly sunny conditions there as we head into Monday and Tuesday. So expecting a, a roller coaster to effect of weather pattern as we head into the next uh, few days there, but no significant rain chances in store for us uh, as we go into the start of next week uh, for us here across uh, South Texas. As we look at future clouds and radar overnight lows dropping into the 40s, so we're going to wake up tomorrow with temperatures in the mid 40s there, so uh, definitely expecting uh, some cooler weather highs tomorrow, only topping out at around 58 60 degrees, so we're going to continue seeing those chilly conditions uh, through tomorrow afternoon there, so expecting mostly clear skies, just cooler temperatures in drier air. And of course, uh, just a reminder that that fire weather risk still in store for us as we head into the overnight hours. Lows tonight dropping into the mid 40s, highs tomorrow in the 60s there. Winds still gusting up to 23 miles an hour. A look at your seven day forecast. We are expecting those temperatures once again to remain on the cooler side, at least leading into the start of the weekend. Highs in the upper 60s for Saturday, Sunday, 74 degrees. President's Day looking quite warm with mostly sunny skies and a high of 80 too, but those temperatures remaining on the uh, chilly side for the next few days with mostly sunny skies for Tuesday.